I'm gonna change out this light today. I'm gonna put it in a different light. So the first thing is to take this one off. This is an LED bulb. So I'll take this off. We'll also turn off the light. All right, I need a Phillips screwdriver. Remove two screws. And then this will turn and pop off. Then I can get access to the wiring. And all I did was turn the light off, the light switch off. But to be safe, you should really turn the breaker off. Don't do what I'm doing. Okay, so. so there are two wire nuts that do need to be removed. When I remove them, then I can remove that light fixture and I can begin installation of the other light fixture. Okay, white is neutral, black is hot, hot is the one that is turned off with the switch. Okay, it's very similar. This should only take me a couple minutes to install. These are the screw holes. The screws are already mounted in the mount above. We'll just place it up there, turn it, and then tighten the screws. First, we have to connect the wiring. So we're gonna connect the black to the black and the white to the white. This does come with the ground wire, so I'll have to make sure to connect that too. Okay, we have the hot connected. Now we're connected to neutral. So what we have here, we have the black connected with this wire nut and we have the weight connected with that wire nut you put the wires together and you tighten them and then this is the screw I'm going to connect I could use a wire nut if I found one but I will try to connect it to that screw now the lamp that was here was a single lamp with an LED bulb and that was 10 watts for 60 watt equivalent So if a ground wire is applied with the light fixture, it's really important that you connect it. Now we have to stuff the wires back up in to the junction box area. On this mount, there are two screw holes. One's on the outside that we're using right now for the old fixture. Two on the inside. I'm gonna move the screws to the inside and we'll see if it'll match up. Once again, put the screwdriver through to match up the screw. the other screw. So we're good. We don't want to over tighten it, but we want it tight enough that the fixture is secure. These are the bulbs I'm using. You can see that it works. 